So, hi guys, it's me again. Um, I didn't know if I was going to run out of time on my other video, and I made these. So if you haven't been able to see these, um, go back to my Simple Share video, and you'll be able to see how I made these and what they were made from. And then I have another project here that I had made and I'm going to raise this up a little so you guys can get a better view alright so let's see um, this is also recycled I don't know if you'll be able to see inside and what it was, was a half gallon container that had milk in it. But um, I cut it down and I punched holes through. This is why I said this one isn't very simple. It's not a, I don't know that those that um, don't crochet would be able to do this particular project unless they made bigger holes. I punched holes with a hole punch all the way around the top. And then I, let's see, I crocheted into the holes and you'll probably see if we can show you those holes. See the holes right there? And See those? Um, so I crocheted into the holes and then I crocheted up a ways. I made um, a handle and then um, I glued some paper to, that's why it looks brown, to the um, container the half gallon container and then over that I glued this lace and it's really wide lace then I put these buttons on the bottom so it can sit and um, I don't know what I'm going to do with it I just wanted to try making something I got all these little glue boogers all over the place <laughs> I wanted to try making something. I had the idea of recycling the container, but I didn't know what I wanted to make with it. So this is what I thought of. And um, yeah, I think it's kind of cute to sit out and it's not specifically Easter. It's just a basket. So um, since there was food in it, it's food safe. You can put food in here. Um, you can, um, sit it out for decoration. You could put uh, flowers in it, like dried flowers, or you, since this is plastic, you can put a tiny pot in it of flowers. I wove this, um, beading through here, and I tied a... a bow here and I uh, glued this flower on and then I glued those flowers on put the beading around the bottom here and there's some right here some blue lace and here's some more of that ribbon that I tied the bows here and then here ha is this was given to me from someone in a in a swap I don't even know what it's called um, but it comes on like a little, um, I don't even think I have any left because there wasn't much here, but it comes on like a little sheet of, um, plastic type stuff or acrylic sheet. So I just added it to decorate, but the buttons are the feet. So I was thinking this would be the front. So it would sit like this, and um, yeah, 
Yeah, so that's what I did there. And um, I want to show you something else I did. So I'm not finished with it, but I'm going to show it to you. So, okay. Here is a ring that I'm making a frame. I'm making something that I'm going to stick in here. It's going to be like glued on and it's going to be paper, but it's going to be a frame. Um, and what I'm going to do and what this is actually is, let me see if I can show you. Um, all right. You see this ring? It's plastic. Well, I saved it from the larger, um, roll and I used it to crochet around and made this frilly ruffly edge here and I'm making a little quote I'm gonna glue in here and then it's gonna be a gift for someone I don't know who but um, I have two people in mind that I might give this to so one of my friends is sick and I thought um, this might you know cheer her up if I put a little quote in there and if you want to see it when it's finished let me know I haven't decided on what I'm going to put in yet but I want to show you some other things that I've been doing and I'm giving these away so let's see here So, this is a butterfly. See that? So, it goes this way. These are the wings. It's a butterfly. Here's a, another butterfly. It's um, green. And this was my attempt at a... Um, doily but after I finished it I thought you know this looks this would look cute for someone who has to wear their hair tied up and then they could put this over their little like make a bun and put this over it to keep their hair all in I thought that was cute for that that's just a bow here's another flower here's a tiny one Here's a different kind of butterfly. Um, here's another... Let's see if I can fix this so you can see it. Here's another butterfly. Um, looks like that. And here are the antlers or antennae or whatever they're called. Here's a little tiny... Um, here's a bigger one. I was trying to make like doily type thing and eh, it didn't come out all that great, but it's all right. Here's a big butterfly. So, and here's like a, maybe this side. Yeah. Um, here's a little pink little butterfly. Isn't it cute? And this is another little pink one. Um, this is just the flower. And this one is made from crochet thread. I should really have thinner thread. Um, I mean a thinner hook it would probably have come out nicer this still has the ties on it but um here's a tiny little flower and here's a three leaf clover and another little flower 
and here's a different sort of um, butterfly that I had made. And did I show you this tiny little thing? Isn't that cute? And here's another one. Made these this morning. I was watching Game of Thrones. Here's a big Mamba Jamba. Look at that one. That would be good for somebody's hair. Here's, um, I don't know exactly. I think I was trying to make a doily, but it <laughs> came out like a flower. Uh, yeah, there's some, oh, here's a big butterfly. That's cute. And then I have this little flower. And then this little white one. So, yeah, I've been working on these. And I'm going to be giving these. Look at this one I made from ribbon. Yep, it's ribbon. I crocheted the ribbon. So I'm going to be giving these out. Let this little one. And that one. And then these two. And then I have another little butterfly. So, yeah, there's um, another flower. There, four-leaf clover. Little pink. So, I think... Um, I'm done with the flowers for now, but yeah, I'm going to uh, package these up and give them out to some um, some people in uh, some swaps I'm doing, and I would like to sell some too, but I'm not sure if um, there's an actual market for crocheted flowers, except for, you know, here's another butterfly, except for me just, you know, making them to give away. So, but this is what I've been doing and my projects. And then I've also been, see them, those clips. There's a whole bunch of tiny little ones that I made. Sam. And then I made a couple big ones that I gave out in some swaps. And I just covered them with this paper tape. Um, it's not... Um, it's not... Um, washi. It's actual paper tape and that's what I used that's how I used it I uh, used the paper tape to cover these so I'm going to put these in some racks and I know it's a long drawn out video I'm sorry yeah, but I hope you guys like what you've seen and if 